Hello everyone, I'm AOD Nightshade, and I'm back with another uh, um, OSVR game. This one here, as you can see, is Dread Halls. Now, Dread Halls was a game that I seen uh, quite a while ago with Oculus uh, Dev Kit 2 video gameplays on uh, YouTube all the time, and it was one that I knew I had to record, even though I knew I would hate myself for it. So, really with that, let's dive into the dungeon. Oh, I may need to readjust my stuff. Uh, does it have the orientation? There we go, orientation reset. Okay. Down we go. Uh... I was so excited when I got head tracking working for this, and I hated myself for it too. Alright, that's really way too sensitive. I may have to actually use the actual gamepad. Okay. I'm surprised I got that first try. Um, okay. So, sprint. Alright. Here we go. Now, I've seen some gameplay of it, and I know somewhat what to expect, unfortunately. So it's not going to be complete terror, but it's still an absolutely terrifying game. <gasps> like that, like that, like that, holy shit, why did that have to happen immediately? Oh my god, just run, just run. Oh god, what was that? I'm in a corner, oh, I'm at a dead end. Open the door, 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 don't fucking open the door! Close the door, close the door, close the door, I'm at a dead end, I'm gonna die, holy fuck, I'm gonna die. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, I was not... I was not ready for that already. I'm so fucked. I don't think I'm gonna be able to complete this game. Shut up. You're not a real noise. Okay, maybe you were a real noise. Holy shit. This game. Oh no. Fuck you, bitch. Fuck you, bitch. There's just things everywhere. Oh my god. Where am I going now? Dead end. Fantastic. Oh, this is where I found that bitch. Oh, Jesus. I don't know what the hell that was. I may just need to nope the fuck out of this game. Oh my god. Down that way. Holy oh, shit, where am I now? Can't see the map that well. There we go. Keep going. 
Keep going. You're probably going to keep going down that path, which is fine with me, which means I can keep going down the other path. Oh my god, this game is so fucking terrifying. If you haven't tried this game out and you like horror experiences, you need to give this one a go. You really do. Because this has got to be one of the worst experiences I've ever had in my life. Shit, I fucking need to go past you. Give me this stuff. What? Uh-oh. Oh god, I started off with this thing right next to me. Where am I at? Alright, so we're back in. And this one creature's right outside the door as soon as I spawn. So I'm going to hide in the corner. Hopefully he doesn't magically appear next to me. It sounds like he's walking around me. Oh no, don't tell me. Is this path literally just a circle around me? Oh, fuck me. Does he come down that path? I don't know if he does. Oh, he's gone. Time to get the fuck out of here. <gasps> oh, fuck me. Back in the spawn. Back in the spawn. <sighs> oh, God. That scared me more. There's two of them. Open this door, 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 open this door. What's that? Open the chest. Hey, oil. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I'm right off of one of the giant paths. There's nothing back here. Alright, so it sounds like you're leaving. So I should have enough time to get out and run. Down this way. Shut up. You're not a real noise. Give me that. Where am I at now? Okay. And I don't remember. I know to get out of here, you just have to make it to uh, one of the exits, which is just a thing going upward, but I just don't know Oh god, I thought that- <gasps> Nope. Okay, where am I at now? Alright. Yeah, so, I know I have to get to an exit, which is at the top of a- or is a- an exit out of here. Literally. It's just- way out of this hole. But where that exit is, I have no idea. It's a dead end, isn't it? Yes, it is. And it's all randomly generated, so every experience is going to be completely new, which is 
a good and bad thing? Because that means that you'll never get the same experience twice. But that also means that you'll be terrified many times over. Nope, not here. What was this way? Oh, that was just a regular door. Have I been here before? No. Oh, weird. Whale. Give me the whale. Thank you. <gasps> oh my god, the skeleton scared me. Uh, what's down here? No idea. That's another thing that's really good implementing, is that you can look down at your uh, map here and figure out what's in front of you. Unfortunately, if you look down in your map, you don't know what could be right in front of you, walking towards you. Which is a very, very ingenious way of incorporating... Well, I don't know where your path is. Actually, where is your path? I shouldn't be seeing... Oh, I need to... Lantern. Whale. Thank you. Um, that's just a note. What's the unwritten note say? Emma started screaming something today? What does it say? Nonsense today. I had to tie her down. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to use two. I can't see my map. What's down this way? A door! Surprise, surprise! Which leads to... God, this has got some good bass going. I can feel it rumbling my freaking brain. <laughs> Alright, what's down... Corridor number two of spooky noises that I don't want to ever encounter. <gasps> oh, fuck! Nope. And that leads back down there. So let's go past this door. Oh, my God. Well, I was starting to calm down. Not anymore. Heart's pumping. Oh, what the heck? That's reorient. Man, I was really off on the reorientation. I'm so glad I never found this door while I was being chased. I would have been dead. I don't know what that noise is. I don't like it. Stoof. Give me the stoof. Alright. Where else can I go? There's a whole section that bottom right that I haven't checked out. So I can try and sneak past and go down that way. Or I can go back up towards the top. Seems longer than I remember. I remember the map being a little bit more square. <sighs> you know what? Fuck it. What's behind the door? Might have just been a scripted thing to try and scare the shit out of me. And it was. There's nothing back here. You fuckers got me. What was that? What was that? God, I hate that thing. Oh, fuck me! Oh, fuck me! Oh, fuck me! Ah! Oh, close that door! Close that door! Hide in the corner. Oh my god. So that's the noise of hers teleporting right next to you. Oh my god.
Oh, thank God. Okay, so I don't think she can go through doors. Which is good. But also really, really, really bad. Alright. So, I didn't see anything in that room, so I'm not going back in that room. Now, there's still more in the bottom right. Oh, God damn it! did you glitch out on me again? Ah. Oh. Well, I don't know if I can get through a full gameplay of this now. Alright, well... In any case, I'm absolutely done. I'm shaking right now. And, oh. Oh my god. Okay, well, that was Dread Halls. I'm working on trying to figure out how to get this fully operational. Uh, like I said with the last video, if you want to see, uh, or if you want to learn how I got this set up, um, I essentially got it set up through Steam VR using Revive and a bunch of other plugins. I can actually create a tutorial video if you guys want to see that. Feel free to uh, comment and let me know. Um, but otherwise, thank you for watching. I will be back with some more OSVR stuff. Bye. Words, this game, I've had oh, God.